To say Fortnite has a large fan base is an understatement. There are so many Fortnite players out there, they could probably occupy a small country called Fortlandia or something. A relatively small portion of this fan base got together to set a Guinness World Record, which got us thinking about all the crazy, unbeatable records that have been set in the Battle Royale game. But before we get into a Guinness World Record and plenty of other unbreakable Fortnite records, subscribe to the gamer and ring that bell to join our notification squad so you never miss any of our Fortnite videos. Setting a Guinness World Record is something to be proud of, even if it's the most obscure thing you could think of, like the longest time spent without blinking. Fortnite posted a video to their official Twitter account showing the Guinness World Record for most participants in a video game emote routine gets set during Paris Games Week, and it was madness. There were 383 cuddle team leaders replicating classic emotes like Hype and Fresh, with one kid absolutely killing it. Our dance moves aren't nearly as good as his. In terms of Guinness World Records, that was the only one set in regards to Fortnite. So it's time to take a look at some of the gamer world records, and we'll start with the longest sniper shot. Gross Big filmed himself getting sniped by Gato Valandia from 491 meters away. Just to give you an idea of how far that is, it's around five football fields. Yep, it's safe to say that Gato Valandia is using a sniper the way it was intended. The longest rocket kill was set by Scrept, who rolled around the map with four rocket launchers. As if that wasn't already overkill, he also had over 90 rockets on him. He was armed to the teeth, to say the least. He decided to make his friend send him on a rocket ride, and as he launched some rockets behind him, one of them connected for a 541 meter kill. We don't think this record will be broken anytime soon. With the Season 6 update, we lost the remote explosives in the Battle Royale. They might come back, they might not. But at least they're still in playground mode for all you C4 fans out there. All three of you. Anyway, It's Cater set the record for the longest C4 kill when he pressed the switch and got himself a 1,368 meter kill. Seeing as the remote explosives are in the vault, this record is literally unbreakable for the time being. When it comes to grenades, it's really hard to get long kills. Oftentimes, your kills are within 20 meters, but not everyone's. Gravel Hater, which is a very specific thing to hate, set the record for longest clinger kill and it was just beautiful. He landed on top of the spire in the middle of the map and got three clingers from a chest that he just threw towards Dusty Divot and got rewarded with a 180 meter kill. Talk about precision. Now it's time to take a look at all the current kill records in solo, duo, and squad. Trust us, they'll leave you with your jaw on the floor. Diddy the Boy set the record for most kills in solo with an incredible 32 kill performance on PC. Unlike most players who go for kill world records, Diddy decided to land at Lazy Links instead of Tilted Towers. He immediately went to work destroying everyone in his path. This is one no-skinner you don't want to mess with. One of the most popular challenges is solo queuing up for team game modes like Duo and Squad, which is exactly what Payam did. The French PC player soloed up for a game of Duo and quickly started racking up the kills. He landed at Tilted Towers and had 16 before leaving the place. What was his final kill count? Oh, not much, just 35 kills, which is more than a third of the players in the field. What a beast! Just like in real life, when playing duos, you have to have a partner who's your equal. Well, Nick Merckx must have found his soulmate in Neoily, since these guys got the exact same amount of kills on their way to setting the record for most kills in a game of duo. Playing on PS4, Nick Merckx and Neoily each got 23 kills for a total of 46 kills. Call these guys a two-man wrecking crew because they almost took out half of the players in the Battle Royale. Insane! Solo vs Squad is one of the toughest challenges to do in Fortnite. For the casual Fortnite player, going up against a four-man squad is suicide. But Tixi just takes care of business like it's no one's business. Playing on PC, the French player found a way to earn 43 kills in a solo versus squad game. He lied and said he got 45 kills on the title of the video, but we know it's actually 43. It ain't easy being Tixi. Hey, that kind of rhymes. Duo versus squad isn't as difficult as solo versus squad, but we still wouldn't recommend it unless you're Galaxy, who, along with his friend Scared, set the record for most kills in duo versus squad on PS4. No offense to Scared, who got a solid 13 kills, but Galaxy carried the team with 31 kills to his name. If you know how to math like we do, then you know that adds up to 44 total kills. Very impressive stuff right there. Trio vs Squad is totally a thing. It doesn't happen often, but it's a thing, and Nox is a master of it. Well, so are Rennick and NMS, but mostly Nox. Playing on PC, these guys were the bringers of pain, taking out anyone and anything that stood in front of them. 
Knox led the team with 22 kills, while Rennick and NMS contributed with 16 and 15 kills respectively. It was a game for the ages, and this team certainly delivered with a total of 53 kills. We'll end these Kill World records with a good old game of squad, where you and three of your best buds get together and play as a four-player unit. Nade XC may have gotten carried by his teammates, but eight kills isn't too shabby. His teammate Forbes earned 25 kills, NextJS got himself 18, and Tactic tacked on another 10 for a grand total of 61 kills. Just how? Oh, and they did this all on PS4 too. This might not be an official record, but as far as we know, no one has beaten Laserbeam's record for the most stunt points ever recorded in Fortnite. Working with a friend, he created a contraption that just infinitely kept his ATK in the air, bouncing from one pad to another. After doing this for nearly the entire hour of allotted time on playground mode and almost getting bored to death, Laserbeam lands the ATK and somehow earned a total of 45,400,600 stunt points. That's ridiculous. Those were some of the most unbeatable records in the world of Fortnite. Are there any records we missed? Do you think you could beat any of these records? Let us know in the comments section below. And don't forget to subscribe to The Gamer for more videos like this one. Thanks for watching.